hi guys welcome back to my channel again this is Ishmita and this video will be about my short tutorial for Korean inspired makeup so yeah today I'm wearing this head wrap uh oh <laughs> so that my makeup won't mess up and my hair won't be a disturbing factor in my face when I put the foundation and yeah it really helps so without further ado let's get started for the moisturizer, today I'm taking this Sea Wit from Sesterma. It contains vitamin C formula which nourishes your skin and keeps your skin hydrated for a longer time. And it also helps improving your skin complexion. It's a really good moisturizer. You just need to put all, all over your face and you just need to massage it like this. And there is one thing that today I'll be using that is my sunscreen and it's from Lotus. I'm gonna mix this with the foundation. I am taking a very lighter shade foundation today because it's a Korean makeup and Korean use light coverage for their base makeup. So yeah. Now I'm gonna put this mixer all over my face with the help of this blender and make sure that your blender is wet. I'm covering all over my face, even the ears and now I'm taking this very basic compact powder to set my foundation. It's uh, from Maybelline and it's in the very light shade again. Yeah, I'm just dabbing it all over my face like really roughly. You should cover all the left out areas also. Now I'm gonna do my eyebrows. Yeah, I'm just brushing my eyebrows today because uh, it's a Korean does not really focuses on eyebrows. And yeah, I will try to make it more natural. With the help of this pencil, I'm just filling it up. A Korean, they basically uh, does the kind of straight eyebrows because they have kind of straight eyebrows see oh these brushes are my favorite part it smells so good I have washed them all and you won't believe that I washed them with shampoo and conditioner Aha. so let's go with eyeshadow today I am only wearing one color that is very kind of coral color I'm only blending it on my eyelid and I'm putting the same color on my lower lid as well Now I'm going to take this kind of liner brush and going to make a winged kind of shape on the outer part of my eye. I'm just using a dark brown color to make a liner shade. I'm simply making the line like a I'm just blending it all over and I'm taking this flat angle brush and spraying some rose water in it and I'm taking a very light golden shimmer color and I'm just applying it on my eyelid and the lower lid also 
Now for the lips, I'm gonna use this lip tattoo from Wow. And yuck, it smells so gross. So I'm just going to apply it on my lips. You should be very gentle and patient to put this all over your lips. Keep it at least for 10 to 15 minutes. Until it gets dry, let's do the blushes. And for the blushes, I'm using the rose shade from Bobbi Brown. And always get a very floppy brush to put your blushes on your face. Now I will curl my lashes and another eye. Let's put some mascara in it. Not a very big amount. I'm just a bit. I'm just putting it on my lashes because I'm not focusing on a very dramatic eye look today. It's a kind of very normal and simple. Now for the lower lashes. Okay. I guess my lips are getting dry but not yet ready so I will just put the highlighter on on my cheeks a little bit on the nose on the tip of the nose even on the chin and a little bit on my forehead oh don't be scared <laughs> So yeah, it got into my teeth and it's like a uh, really tasted like uh, rotten berries. <laughs> so yeah, I'm pulling it off and yeah, the weight is still worth it. It does not look bad though. Hana to set. I am matching my look with this cute air bearings. It's a fork and a spoon. And it also comes with a very little needle in it. It's so cute and yeah, I love this. And for another air. Now it's a complete look. And all I can say is it's my addition for Korean inspired makeup. So if you like this, you can try this out and do let me know in the comment section below if you really want to try it out. And once again, thank you so much for watching my video and keep supporting. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel and get the notification bell so whenever I upload a new video, you will always get notified. And to like, share, and comment. So thank you guys. Love you. All bye.